，等会儿。啊，这一直多也少不着我噻。你看。Yes, you do. You blow yourself up and you grab it, though. Nope. You can't grab it. Anyway, let's get back out here. Okay. <laughs> Ah,、oh, this avatar works really weird in some light, though. Let me see. Ah,、uh, ah.、Uh. Yup. So if we go in shade, we're now in the shade. So I guess if I just stay in the shade for a little. Oh, right. Um. <laughs> Hi everyone. It's Tessa Spade today on a nice, wonderful, wonderful Sunday. Come here. I'm gonna get myself nice and normal here. Okay. The ultra wide with exploding egg thing. I think where is that? An exploding Mozrios? Yeah. Anyway, this is Pat with Spade. It is Sunday, April twenty first, two thousand twenty four, and it is day one hundred and twelve. Tickle the situation lightly see, and see, don't Tara, thrust at it. You see, Tara, I remembered this time, April twenty first, because you have yesterday. I get today. Anyway, um, I can't really be on here too long. Because we need to get out there and set the grill up. It is Lilia's slam day. She needs her grilled shrimp today, so I have to. I have to quite、uh, under the sink with cold water. Spot colossal shrimp. Peel them. Dip them on skewers, and I have to make. We we need to make some kind of sauce for them. Might do a. Might do a. Uh, maybe I'll just do some honey on them for for Lilia, and then for maybe for Buttercup I'll do regular honey. I don't know. I need lime pepper because I don't have any lemon pepper. But I can do that. And I have one filet mignon, but I I want to get some um some more thickened breasts out. Uh, I'm just trying to think about what kind of sauce to put on them because I don't really have anything unless I do it from scratch. Which is no problem at all, because I I learned very quickly last night. We make an amazing curry. We we had um just plain old um beef and curry sauce on rice with Brussels sprouts last night, and the curry turned out fantastic. I can post up the recipe for the curry because this is just me like getting started, like learning to make my own curry. It's actually really, really good, and yes, I do use chocolate in my in my curry, and it is really good. No, I don't use sweetened chocolate. That would be gross. I use um. Oh, now the pinky's doing it. Come on, now the pinky's doing it. The pointer's kind of working, but now the pinky's not, and now the big other. Ah,、uh, uh, but I use um. Unsweetened cocoa powder. You don't want to go using the the. You don't want to use sugar in it. That'd be that'd be silly. So I don't use like regular old chocolate or anything. Man, this really really glows in sunlight. Is that a whole? Oh, uh oh. It, it's 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 that thing. You, it's that thing. You get too close to it, it blows up. It blows up. Oh, it's supposed to be over here. What? Let's uh, let's just go back into shade, so I'm not blowing so freaking much. I don't know why some avatars do that in terms of lighting. I tried to, I tried to fix it, but I couldn't find any solutions on on this avatar to deal with the glowing hair. But、uh, yeah, I'm just trying to figure out. I could do another curry on the chicken. But we had curry yesterday, so we don't need to do grilled curry today. So I could, like I said, I could do something with honey and hot honey. I'm just trying to figure out what. Oh, I think、oh, lime. I have almost. I have so many different spices and seasonings. I could come up with something, but it needs to stand out from what we had yesterday because that curry beef was really, really good. Just give me a little. It just needs to be something different from last night. It's kind of big with what? Oh, if you notice,、uh, our mood is、uh, definitely better compared to yesterday, and that's a、uh, uh, that's a fault of one of our own little、uh, noggin things, if you know what I mean. Just some days are really easy, some days just、uh, they're not. Some bit, some days aren't so easy. Today's an easier day. Why do I get the easier days? Cause it's me. Ah, 
Yeah. But we're just enjoying being outside. I mean, been outside IRL, it's actually quite pleasant. 64, 65 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's a really nice, pleasant day. And uh, tomorrow is supposed to be... It said 74 Fahrenheit, so that's great, because we've had so many days we're in the upper 90s Fahrenheit, and yesterday was like 49 Fahrenheit, and storming, was that yesterday? Yeah, it stormed yesterday, and, and the previous night it started storming pretty bad, so it's been wet. We can't do any yard work right now. We'll do, we'll do the yard work tomorrow and Tuesday when it dries a little more. Because remember, if you have the electric yard tools, every one of them will say, do not use when your yard is wet. If you do that, you are just asking for trouble. They don't handle well in wet, in wet environments. So let it dry just a little, just a little more. And tomorrow should be dry enough to have enough evaporation. In order for us to do the yard work, which I look forward to doing, because I, I want to, I want our yard to look really, really nice this year, nice and livable. And plus, the faster I get that done, I can take, uh, I can have Tara take care of the um, the dirt mounds that need to have all that soil moved to the backyard and the easement to fix the erosion in the yard from you know this erosion. Erosion. Fun. Yeah, I can't, I really can't keep this video too long. I'm sorry, but I mean, at the time of recording, it's 5.04 p.m. And I have one hour, one hour to make sure that I get the drill started. And I know from the last time I grilled, it, it is a right blooming mess on those grill grates from the, um, from the peak. We, the jalapeno peat marinade that we had on the, uh, on the chicken. What was that? Was that last week or the week before? No, it was last week. It was last week. We had the jalapeno peach chicken, which was really, really tasty. Everyone loved it. Even Buttercup liked it. I will say, or Buttercup's grandmother's starting to get on my nerves a little bit when it comes to us serving spicy food. He doesn't. We're not serving the grandparents' spicy food. We're having it, um, not like super, super spicy food. I eat the super spicy. But we make some spicy stuff, and they, and she's been yelling at me, saying I need to not serve spicy food here because I'll give the kids ulcers. That's not how ulcers work. You don't get ulcers from spicy food. Spicy food can hurt an ulcer because you already have an ulcer. But spicy food does not give you ulcers. In fact, spicy food can help boost immune systems. I don't know why. I don't know how. When it shows cultures that eat spicier foods are generally healthier. So I like I like the spicy food. And plus, Buttercup's been enjoying it. Sweet Pea's getting a little more into it. With balance, we're not doing anything, you know, too hot for them. I'm not going to go burning their mouths. But that nice little bit is, it's tasty stuff. Yeah, for some reason, the grand, the, especially my grand, their grandmother, firmly believes that they shouldn't be having spicy food, and that I'm abusive for giving them spicy food. If they like it, they like it. If they don't, they don't. And right now, they like the spicy food. It's not abuse. And anyway, anyway, I need a nice good stretch. Definitely, actually, I do need a really good stretch. One that I really want right now is I want to do that little whole reach and touch your toes. As, um, and the more I do this VR stuff, the more I'm realizing that if I stand in place for too long, my, my back just gets really comfort. Oh, there's someone here. Oh, hang on. What's up? Hey, how's it going? I don't remember who I, when I added you, but, uh... uh... it was probably at least two, two and a half years ago, at the very least. Hmm. Okay, well, I used to be a Stalfa Rider of Black. That would be it. I, rem I remember because we were both, uh, back at 
bands of a salvo. Oh, yeah. I used to be unfamiliar to Rio at that time. Oh, I remember you now. All right, you take care. I have fun, Alistair. I just hit the go home button, too. Geez, I'm still loading. There I go. There I go. Well, um, that was a lesson, wasn't it? Let me get changed real quick. Do something kind of pump through. No. Yeah. Okay. So, you know what? No. Um. Let's just do that one for right. Cool. So that was a uh, that was a lesson, wasn't it? Make sure that when you're doing your videos to not put friends plus. I've done that how many times now? My nephew came in on us on Friday, and now we had Alistair who used to be a vapid Espalco fan like myself and Tara. Which uh I'm gonna be a lover cool. Oops. I want that going. If it's going, it's gonna get me in trouble. It's gotten me in trouble before. Gotta remember these things. But yeah. Uh <laughs> that, that, that's a nice pleasant day. I, I, I was having fun with everyone. I lost my train of thought when that person came in, because I wasn't expecting anyone to come in anyway. Usually the usually it's the same the usual call person. This one was a little different today. I mean, it wasn't too much of a problem, but, you know, it, it, was, it was fun saying hello to someone at least. But I need to be a lot more careful about these things because, uh, I know there are too many people in VR today who hate others that record. And if you're in somewhere where other people, you gotta hit that. <laughs> well, that was a face. Uh, that was not the face I was after. What is this one? <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get, you know, start to get going because, like I said at the time of recording, it's 5.11 p.m. I need to get out there and I need to do that grilling. It is definitely time for that, so. Ah, uh, well, this, this avatar really does get affected by all forms of light. That is, that is cool. But at the same time, it makes the hair glow way too much. And I've been trying to get that to not happen so much because some people really, really don't like that. But uh, there's not much I can do with the public. If I can find the person and speak to the person who made this, I would love to have it for myself. I love this avatar. There are outfit changes that I would make, of course, because I'd like things a little more um conservative. But that's just me. That's just me. Anyway, this is Pess of Spade on your wonderful, wonderful Sunday afternoon and evening, April 21st, 2024, and of course, once again, it is day 112, I'm not forgetting, Tara, I'm not forgetting, it's day 112. I, or we, we, whatever, you, you get the idea, we feel fantastic, absolutely amazing, but it's time I think going so I can go make that shrimp. That's gonna be a wonderful, wonderful dinner. I can tell you that much. This is, we even have pork on the pot that's going straight on the grill. If you've never had, if you've never had grilled, grilled corn on the cob straight off the grill, no thin foil or anything, you are missing out. You've got to try some grilled corn. We're gonna do the grilled corn tonight. We're gonna have the shrimp. We're gonna have some chicken. It's gonna be a wonderful night. In the meantime, everyone, Enjoy the rest of your day, and we will. S and I, I will see everyone on Tuesday, as you know. That's supposed to be the the special pair, and I do something together. We gotta figure out how we're gonna do that because uh, that felt complicating and rushed when we did it Tuesday evening. We'll we'll figure it out. Anyway, you take care, everyone.